few months ago, Reddit for Business announced a few new targeting features that are slowly rolling out within Reddit ads accounts. These features do a couple things. Some of them will show you more insights on who you are trying to reach or who you may want to reach. And another is going to be a brand new feature that you may or may not have in your account yet. So let's just hop into Reddit ads. We'll go into an ad group so you can see where these new features live. This Pay Media Pros video is sponsored by Optio, the smarter, more efficient way to manage Google Ads. Optio's platform operates as a second pair of eyes on your accounts, regularly monitoring performance trends to make data-driven optimization suggestions for keyword strategies, bid optimizations, ad copy creation, and more. Better yet, you can save time by implementing their suggested changes directly in their user-friendly interface. Optio is extending their free trial period for Paid Media Pros viewers for 60 days, meaning you get two full months of testing and using Optio on your accounts before you pay a dime. If you're interested in giving it a shot, click the link on the screen right now or in the video description to get started. Within our ad account, I went to an ad group that we already had created, but it doesn't matter whether you're going into a current ad group or you're building a new campaign and making a new ad group where you will find these targeting updates will all be in the same place. So the first one we're gonna talk about will be within the interest groups. This one will be pretty quick. Now interest groups within Reddit are determined based upon what users have recently interacted with. And Reddit claims that this is their most popular form of targeting. While that's great, I've honestly have rarely used interest groups. Not because they don't work, it's just that for my particular clients, they need to reach a very specific audience. And if you look at these overall categories, even if you expand upon a few, you can see that they can be pretty broad. So if you are trying to cast a wide net, these can be very helpful. But recently, Reddit expanded the number of interest targeting options that are available. The last milestone number for interest options was 66. Well, now it's up to 152. So if it's something that you haven't tested in a while or haven't even looked at in a while, maybe come back to this. It's quite possibly that they made a new category or subcategory that best fits the audience that you were trying to reach. So more interest groups, that's a simple one. Now the next few updates are all about targeting communities. In my mind, I still call this subreddit targeting. Because if we click within this community audience field, if you've watched any of our other Reddit ads videos in the past, you might notice that this looks a little different. They've really just enhanced this feature. So right by clicking it, they're recommending options. And since I don't have any other targeting options selected within this campaign, yes, these are pretty broad. But one of the newer features is that they start giving you suggestions after you've already typed in a few options. Let me show you what I mean. I just typed in video games, pretending like I want to target something from there. They've always given us the estimated amount of users within the group. But now besides seeing just the particular subreddit, we get a little bit more information about the category of the community. And these are essentially the topic tags. So if I'm looking to target any interest in video games, yeah, I probably don't want to go people who want to ban video games. So I'll just add a few. And as we see, there's some recommendations. And this is another one of the newer features. It's community suggestions. Based upon the ones that I'm currently selecting, Reddit now recommends similar options that you may want to select. And if you're not quite sure, you can highlight over one of them. You'll get a description of the community. You will still get the estimated users. You'll still get what category it's in, but now it's easier to see what type of community you will be targeting because Reddit has now added a link where you can go visit the community. And this is something that we have always recommended with Reddit, really understanding who makes up the communities that you're targeting, but also get an idea of the tone of the community. How do people interact with this community? So it's easier to research if one, you're even in the right place, but you can also get quicker insights on potentially what type of creative you are going to need to be successful in targeting this specific community. So I can just go down, see what people in this community talk about. That image is just another ad, that's fine, but also potentially get an idea of what they're sharing and what type of creative I might want to put in front of them. If I go and look at other communities, I'm gonna type in a totally different topic just for the sake of this video. By looking at some of these options, some not appropriate. Here's a good example of where the topic tags might be beneficial. Yes, there are plenty of baseball ones here that make sense, but if you're not really interested in reaching people in terms of racing games, you might wanna dive in deeper to see if it is the right audience. Because sometimes the name of the community doesn't clearly state what the discussions of that audience really entail. So getting deeper insights into the community options and having an easier way to research them can hopefully help you research which ones you may want to target and better reach your target audience with Reddit ads. Now, the newest feature within Reddit ads, probably have already seen it on the screen, is keyword targeting. 
Now, keyword targeting will only work to target the conversations placement within Reddit. Let me show you what I mean. I'm gonna start typing in some keyword options. Once I did that, just like communities, we are seeing options. You can choose to add all of them, but I'm just gonna select a few. Okay, good enough. So then if I scroll down, we are still within the ad group. The option to show up in the Reddit feed has gone away. Usually there's two placement options here, but since I added keywords as my targeting option, the only placement we get is the conversations placement. If I do scroll back up, we see that there is a bulk entry option. So you can see, you can just paste in a good list of keywords, one per line, and you can add up to 500 keywords total per ad group. For whatever reason, if you need to add more, I would consider breaking up your list into smaller groups and then testing it out in different ad groups within Reddit. As of right now, Reddit only supports this feature in the English language. You have to assume more will be coming later, but this is still so brand new. Now, if I cancel out of this, you've probably noticed that there aren't the typical match types that we're expecting because this isn't search. Even though other platforms like Quora do have some match type options. As of right now, Reddit doesn't. Then of course, with keyword targeting, there has to be some restrictions. Some of those restrictions are using special characters within your keywords. So exclamation points, ampersands, plus minus equals, those sort of things, those will get rejected. And then of course, anything targeting sensitive topics goes against any laws or Reddit's policies on what you can advertise for. Of course, those are gonna be restricted as well. So if you feel you're in a sensitive industry, read up on Reddit's advertising policies and understand that the keyword targeting options will definitely follow those policies. But after you've selected your keywords, you've created your ads, you've launched the campaign, let your campaign run for a little bit, you can head back to the ad groups level. These are just ad groups. Let's say this second one right here is the one where we added keywords. If you click on these three dots, you will see that there is an option for view insights. Now, this is our demo account. We don't run anything with this, but here you will see an option for keywords. Keyword level information will not show up within this report, but you will be able to download a CSV. And within that CSV report, if you're using Excel, whatever, you will then be able to see the keyword level insights within that downloaded report. So that is how you'll be able to assess the keywords that you're targeting to see if they're benefiting your campaigns. And those are the latest features within Reddit ads. If you haven't used the platform in a while, maybe circle back and potentially see if any of these newer features can help you better find your target audience. I personally haven't used the keyword targeting option yet, but I'm hoping to in a few clients. And as always, if you have any questions about these new features or just Reddit ads in general, feel free to leave us a comment. Thanks for watching our video. We really appreciate it. If you liked it, give us a thumbs up below. If you really liked it, maybe think about subscribing to the Paid Media Pros YouTube channel and you'll get alerted every time a new video drops. If you really, really liked it, you can help support the channel by checking out some of the t-shirts that we're wearing on our merch shelf, as well as looking at the Super Thanks button.